Hey friends, here's your help for chapter 1.2, number 10. Now, number 10 is not your assignment, and this is just an example to help you out with number 9 and a few other problems. Now, the, the instructions say in exercises 9 to 34, because there are different rounding results in different estimates, there is not one single correct answer to each exercise. So it's okay to have different answers, just be in the right range. And then it says, after you do your estimation, uh, check it with a calculator. All right, so here's number 10 and how it all goes. Okay, big marker for this. Uh, number 10 says 248 plus 797. All right, so step one is to do your estimate. Okay, my estimate, 248 to me, I'm going to round that to 250. Okay. Um, I just like the number 250. Also, this 8 um, bumps up really nicely. Okay. Keep my plus sign there. This 797, I'm going to bump that up to 800. Okay. And add those two nice and simply in my head. 250 plus 800 is 1050. Now, this is the first part of my answer. The second part is to check this with a calculator. So I'm going to do my little calculator symbol right here. But I'm actually just going to ask my assistant, Alexa, what is 248 plus 797? 248 plus 797 is 1045. Alexa says 1045. And I'm going to draw a happy face right there because my estimate and the actual answer are very close. That's it.